this question tests whether you can correctly identify which bonds are being broken and formed in a chemical reaction, and your ability to calculate the heat of reaction. Reading the question, we find that we need to use the bond enthalpies given on the information sheet to estimate the change in enthalpy for the reaction of CHBr3 with Cl2 to give CCLBr3 and HCl. So let's start planning the answer. The enthalpy change is equal to the bond energies of the bonds being broken minus the bond energies of the bonds being formed. To get the bond energies, pull out the data sheet. Inspect the reaction carefully and you'll see that carbon hydrogen and chlorine chlorine bonds are broken. We look these two bond types up in the table and note their energies. A carbon chlorine and a hydrogen chlorine bond are formed. And again, we note these values. Solving the problem is a matter of adding together the bond energies of the broken bonds and separately the bonds formed, and then subtracting the second sum from the first. The value, negative 107 kilojoules per mole, is a negative quantity consistent with an exothermic reaction. Finally, check your answer. Most errors in this sort of question come from simple mistakes like looking up the wrong bond energies or making the wrong subtraction. All fine here, so we're done.